I'm Ms. Castanon, proud principal here at Summit High School. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. You may now be seated. Good morning, Skyhawks. Today is Friday, January 14th, 2022. I'm Leo Ortiz Matney, and you're watching Skyhawk News. <music> Bottled water. Bottled water is available each morning at both thermal scanner entrances. If you want water during the day, you can use this bottle at the water filling stations located around the campus. The cafeteria also sells water and lunch. You will need to have an account in order to purchase water as the cafeteria cannot accept cash. Law Enforcement Academy. The Law Enforcement Academy is a two course sequence offered Saturdays at Fontana High School for any Fontana Unified student in ninth through 12th grade. It is a year long program. This class meets Saturdays, 7.30 a.m. to 4 p.m., starting January 15, 2022. Please see your counselor to sign up today. Textbook and novel return. Attention all students. If you have textbooks or novels that you are no longer using, return them to the library to avoid fines. So you think you're smart? Let's see if you can answer these questions on getting schooled. All right, this is the first getting schooled of the new year. Ladies, gentlemen, and everything in between, I am Ruben Gabriel Reyes. This is David Quintana. And this is Extra. It's Extra Edition, baby. We back at it again. Hey. We're back. <laughs> it feels good to be back, baby. Yes, all right, it is good to be back. Let's start off with the hardest question of all. Who are you? Uh, my name's Anthony. And? I'm Luis. Ah, cool, getting schooled again. All right, all right, all right. Hey, lovebirds. You are? Isabella. Extra uh, director, producer, uh, I'm not writing all that. <laughs> uh, JB. <laughs> Sophia. Lizette. Penelope. Natalie, Natalie, Brianna, Brianna. Okay. What? How do you find the area of a rectangle? Oh, uh, isn't it just length times width? Length times width. All right. Are you going with him? Yeah, length times width. All right. Sounds good. Pretty easy. Come on, smart guy. The area of a rectangle. Uh, you length times width. Yo, is that right? I didn't hear you. Oh no. <laughs> what did you say? I have no idea. I wasn't listening to him. <laughs> For a rectangle? Yeah. I don't know. You don't accept? Yeah, yeah. I don't Isn't know. Is it like dirt or something? Dirt. No, Eric. No, what? <laughs> this is the formula, right? It is dirt. The formula. The formula. No, yeah, yeah, the formula. I don't know. So it's the rectangle. Right. You look at the... Look at the what? The, the, the size. Line. And the, the width. width. And the width. And then and you the multiply and add it or something. Yeah, something. Like how it. Okay, that. I, I, area of a rectangle. Uh, like, <laughs> is it like wait, area? area. <laughs> is it like half time? <laughs> wait, hold on. Half. <laughs> Do you guys got a different answer? Wait, wait, is it, your feel? No, that is it. Length times height. Length times height. Oh yeah, oh. no, it's base times height, no? That's like a triangle trap. No, no. Okay. Rectangle. Rectangle. Wait, we're talking about rectangle. Yes. Oh, dude, wait. Length times five. Okay, my length times five. Definitive answer is length times five. All right, sounds good. Length times width. I don't know. Length times width. Length times width. Oh, you guys are so confident. I love this. I love the energy. What is a country that starts with the letter U? Oh, Ukraine. Ukraine? All right. Yeah. I don't know. You started doing math? No, I'm just... 
gonna go with the we said. We said You're gonna go with Ukraine? Yeah. All right, now let me ask you this one last final question. What country are you in right now? United States of America. <laughs> United States of America. Perfect. I was about to say California. That's what I'm talking about. California? Ukraine. Uh, Russia. Ukraine. I don't know. You did not expect the same answer, not this week? I'll get back to you on that. Well, she's getting back to me. Yeah, I'll get back to you on that too. Ah, oh, there's two of them. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Udu Gawai. <laughs> Nali, what are you saying? It's Udu Gawai. What's that? It's, it's a country? That's a country? Yeah. Oh. It's in Latin America. Yeah. You, you didn't know. Yeah, Oh, oh, oh. I got it, I got it. Nice. Ukraine. Oh, wait, Ukraine? Wait, United States of America, is that a country? Wait, you? <laughs> wait, wait, you? Is it a country? Wait, you? I don't know, is it a country? Yeah, United States of America. Are you right? sure? That's a country. I don't know. I, that's a country. I don't think it's a country. But the United States of America. Is a country. Are you, you guys are going with the United States? I'm going with Ukraine. Wait, Ukraine? Ukraine, bro. Like, <laughs> Ukraine. No. Ukraine? No. Oh, I'm just kidding. You okay, can't my yeah. final answer. Ukraine? Alright, sounds good. Ukraine. I was gonna say that. Well, you know what? As far as I'm concerned, okay. now you can't. Now you can't. Why? I don't know. <laughs> Where do you live? Oh, <laughs> they, they did it. They did the thing. I they actually did the thing. That should have been the number one answer. I was in America. <laughs> United States. America! We for you! Hey guys, I'm Annabella Lopez and I'm your host for today's new series, What Is This? <laughs> okay, so today our guests are Leilani, Bella, Daniel, and today we are going to be pop quizzing them on some instruments from our music department. Okay, so the first instrument we have is very small, and one of you guys could take the first guess, whoever. <laughs> a flute. Okay, okay. It, there's a different name, it's like a smaller one. Um, I don't know. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, a clarinet. <laughs> I'm well, it has these little it's gotta be a fiddle, right? A fiddle? A fiddle. No no no. <laughs> <laughs> the flu and then it has something in front of it. It starts with a P. <laughs> yeah. It's a piccolo. Okay, good job. Round of applause. Okay. Um so the next instrument we have is kind of big. It has like a little bell at the bottom and it has the keys that go. Huh? You can tell it's a. It's, a, what it, it's reed instruments. Yeah. One of those. Oh. those a woodwind? Woodwinds. Yes. Thank you. It's a little funky. Mm. Mm. I don't know. Is that excellent? I don't know. <laughs> Now, let's pass it over to AJ with sports. Hey, Skyhawks. I'm AJ Brown, and I'm here to catch you up with a little sport. Our girls' basketball team competed against Carter High on Tuesday and won by just over 40 points, and their whole squad wasn't even there. Unfortunately, our boys did not play Tuesday due to cancellation from the other team, but will play at home next Tuesday. Our boys' soccer team tied 1-1 -to -one with Sanji on Tuesday. Let's take a look at this week's Athlete of the Week. Hi, 
Hi, my name is Fernando Montion. I am a senior here at Summit. I play soccer. My position is goalkeeper. I've been playing it for two years here at the school, and I am this week's athlete of the week. First of all, I started playing soccer when I was five, and my dad got me into it because he loved it, so I decided to play it, and I fell in love with that as well. My dad also inspired me to play to play soccer because he loved it since he was a kid and ever since I was born he knew I was going to love the same sport as well. The one who keeps me motivated are obviously my parents and my coach because I was one of those guys that would give up easily and they will always tell me be the best out there whether it's at practice or at the game. My goals for this season is obviously to win the league, um, lead the team to CIF and obviously if we go to CIF and if we win it that would be a huge success. Um, any shout outs I will go to obviously coach Griffith for keeping the team going when we didn't have no coach as also, also as well for my soccer boys. It may get annoying but whoever I love them. Some of the games got canceled this week for unforeseen reasons, but will be scheduled again at a later time. Well, that's all I have for this week, Skyhawks. I'm AJ Brown, and I'm happy to have been able to assist you guys today. See you guys on the court. Well, that's all I have for you this week, Skyhawks. I'm Lee Ortiz Matney, and this has been Skyhawk News. See you next time. As we soar through the ages, as we take to the skies, we spread our wings of blue and silver. As we fly with skyhawk pride, loyal in our hearts, body, spirit, mind, we come, we learn, we lead the way for. Three, that's a magic number. Yes, it is. It's the magic number. Three, somewhere in this hip hop soul community. Was born three, they stub at me, and that's a magic number. What does it all mean? Difficult preaching is posthumous pleasure. Pleasure in preaching starts in the heart. Something that's... Can I have my ball back, please? Maybe you beat us in the 3v3. I don't even have a team. Well, then I guess you better go find one. <laughs> Hey, what's up? Who are you guys? I'm supporting character number one, and this is my buddy, supporting character number two. We're here to help. You need a team to get your ball back, right? Yeah, but these guys are super good. Do you guys even know how to play basketball? Watch this. I watch Space Jam. Which one? With the bomb. The better one, of course. Oh yeah, that one! Yeah. Alright, let's just do this, man. Yeah. yeah! Yo, look! They're playing basketball! Uh, all around the world. Uh, to the beach, y'all. They're playing basketball! Uh, all around the world. Well, my team right here. Woo! Bro, this is seriously who you brought? He looks like a fat Elvis Presley. He looks like he just came out of Planet of the Apes. And you look like you just came out of elementary school. <laughs> hey, you asked for a team, right? So come on, let's play. All right, it feels a deal. But don't get mad when you're on the ground.
favorite sport. Uh -huh. I like the way to dribble up and down the court. I keep it so fresh on the microphone. I like no interruption when the game is on. I like slam dunk to take me to the hoop. Yeah. My favorite play is the alley you I like to pick and roll. I like to get big go and it's basketball. Bow wow, let's go. Time out, time out! Supporting character number two, are you okay? Oh. Come on, man! Get body, bozo. Yo, I think you might need a sub, bro. I'll sub in. Who I got? I'm not playing against LeBron. Bro, it's 24. You really think they got a chance? All right, let's ball. Everybody get up, it's time to slam now. We got a real jam going down. Welcome to the Space Jam. Space jam. Here's your chance, do your dance at the Space Jam. All right. All right. Danny, you ready? I can't do it, man. Yes, you can. Thanks, LeBron. I learned it from you, man. What's up, boss? What? Boss? Don't you go to my school? Well, yeah, but I also own part of the Lakers. Anyways, you guys look great out there. I think I got some space for you in the team. On, On the, the Lakers. Lakers? Yeah, AD is still injured, and we traded Russell Westbrook for a bag of chips. We have plenty of room for you guys. Yeah, let's go! Oh,